right, so this particular news will come as a shock to a lot of people, especially um we need the uh, football chief. We are getting a new information at Air Patch uh, Mohammed Kudus faces a ban. Uh, this has to be with and uh, this has to do with a uh, year recently the actions be all year were filled. Now this is so serious because the FA Commission in the United Kingdom, you know, they've even uh, brought out a lengthy statement and even we are learning say, it wouldn't just be this much. Uh you see I know Tottenham has a theme now and uh, they've been uh, reprimanded that they are also facing fines. Aside from that too, uh, Onu Kudu Sankasa is also facing other fines. Now, Nose Kudu is a very good player, but then no uh, team, okay, uh, no team will want to burden him or herself with so much a player they be able to do to trouble because the team is bigger than and any player who is who also feels big now um we'll be getting into details about this all all, all of this issue and you'll be on any basically knows about all everything about kudus and whatever is going on on it kind of predicted this day and one thing to want you to notice is for more i'm going video you know of what really led to this you know share this particular video here but we continue so that was what you saw, Mohamed Kudus um, not at his own best. But answer the betrain a year uh expert Amenian Wahumano. So no, let me put this on the screen for you guys to know how serious this is. Now, uh FA spokesperson they posted this on the official uh Twitter handle, and as you can see, they are going based on regulation acts to discipline Mohammed Mohammed Kudus and also the theme. This is very serious because initially we we're looking at this like it's just one thing. Now they posted to uh your friend is saying lengthy. Uh, and I said two bullets talking about pages that uh, they are saying is uh, FA Ebenyane day and aside from that too and, and aside from FA getting his own two and, and aside from FA getting his own two what will happen is that at the end of the day Mohammed Kudus will also be getting his own now look here Nesha Adewe Osha the more posty ever what we've put on the discuss a regulation and discipline update Tottenham Hospital West Ham United and Mohammed Kudus have been charged uh, following following their Premier League match on Saturday, 19th October. Again, I say Tottenham Hotspur allegedly failed to ensure that their players didn't behave in an improper or provocative way around the 82nd minute. Again, West Ham United allegedly failed to ensure that their players didn't behave in a proper on or provocative matter, uh, provocative and or violent way in the same way. Uh, that is not the only thing about it. Uh, again, I say regulation and discipline update. Mohamed Kudus allegedly acted in improper manner and violent conduct after offense that he was sent off for tottenham hospital west ham united and Mohamed kudus have until thursday 24th october to provide their responses now i told you said this issue you know, i'm not an expert in football um first of all in sending you now air course so no uh we've been speaking a lot behind the scenes but is this a bad news for Mohamed kudus Yes, thank you um, once again, my brother. Mm -hmm. It is a very, very, very bad news for Mohamed Kudu and a very bad news for Ghana in general. Okay. For Ghana, wow. That's... Uh, I think, mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. Because going forward, you know, um, it's very useful temper. Mm -hmm. And let's also not forget that Tema Oyesano, he still was feeling... Um, by four goals to one. Ah, he was even their best player at that moment. You see, out of frustration, any idea, no? And I'm could be a star. Going forward, no, the reason why I said it's going to affect him and affect Ghana as a nation here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It really seems a picture to the outside world say, oh, already Ghanaian, they know Ghanaian as in discipline. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, doing this, also brings a whole lot of things into consideration. Okay. Uh, uh, so I want to ask, this reminds me of um, player Bia, all of us are familiar with, that is Sule Muntari. Now, Kudus is very good, but Sule Muntari is way off than Kudus Mohammed. okay? But as you are saying, you know, also is really going to affect him and all of that. Uh, are we looking, say, Bia, Tottenham, bit Marcus, okay, Kudus is now being a burden instead of a blessing, so we should let him go. Obeka said they did a similar thing to, uh, Barcelona did a similar thing to Messi. Ebra now, I said, Messi, no, or my problems with team, the same thing for Ronaldo with uh, yeah, Manchester United. So, 
what is really going on? What are some of the uh, things that will be seen? Some of them maybe a bit loose because you see, I see FIFA some more banning on, and you are seeing so it's not just one match. What are some of the things implications? Yeah, implications is that could be very you know, very first he'll be fine. He will be fine. He's also um he was supposed to serve um just a match or two matches as a man. Mm-hmm. But from my sources and from my information I'm going to say he's going to serve three matches. Three matches, wow. And aside that yeah, three matches. And aside that then you know, he's also um um, um He's also being fine, but I'm not really sure about the exact amount he's being fine, so I don't want to put any figure out there. Okay. But going forward, I think the kudos in general to me, so he deserves a better team than West Ham. Okay, so maybe me cast or Tottenham, but team Ben or West Ham? Yes. Oh, oh, okay. And yeah, I'm, people will groom me in the comment section. They say Tottenham, so West Ham. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. You see, I think the kudos deserves better going forward. You no, know, mm-hmm. he really, really needs to. Um, and I mean, you can say football is a game. Uh, tempest, I was so especially when you are being, um, when you are, when you are down. Mm-hmm. Tempest, I was so So I'm not really much surprised by the yeah, or yeah, you know. But in all, no, so the kind of time, I thought that he deserves better. Even though he's good, he's performing. I feel, or in my opinion, I see a West Ham element to could be. He is pleasing, or if they feel like he's become a bad image, they are going to um, 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 offload him. I feel that some way, somehow, it's a good call. But it's been a good call, no? you should also consider the fact that if West Ham are offloading him, you see, team men are all cool. There are things that have shown interest and the likes of um, Liverpool have shown interest. Things from Saudi have also shown interest. Yeah, and all that. yeah, yeah. He, going, going forward, no, I feel like he, no, I have the home and, 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 and the report in the book, I said, and then team group, who me are, yeah, yeah, where me and two are, it's true. I see, I see. So, do you think Saban is saying because thought, uh, on the team in West Ham, they've also come into the picture? The same thing for the other team to Tottenham Hospital. Do you think, say, um, the, the team Becker so okay, see, I know we are subjecting uh, kudus to therapy. I was so called certain sessions, I was so called anger management class. What, what, what do you think some of the actions will, 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 what will be some of the actions? And I said, now, can also uh, this could be a wake up call. And also, the second question follow up will be say, uh, there's been calls say, okay, Obi move you moving call a Saudi team. I think that's a Mwajan and Komu in Omaka say, okay, go for the back. But what's the one now? You own Kudus, 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 it's now Prana Koinja. The team will ultimately sell you at a low price. So, the, the, the first one has to do with what are some of the actions the team will take against? Would they take punitive actions against him himself? Or they will tell him, they will subject him to anger management. Or what would they do? Would they also ban him from the pitch? What will happen? I think that every single person who follow football at the piano will tell you that what could you do? Uh, yeah, something very normal in football. Normal? But bro, for um, the one who said so normal. Let's not forget. Mm-hmm. Let's not forget the 2006 World Cup. Oh, it's Germany. Yeah. Um, Zinedine Zidane, legend. Mm-hmm. Also, got very serious man or head by say, uh, Marco Materazzi. Mm-hmm. He narrowed the future of the uh, Italian national team and the team line. So, I also had several or similar situations that were happening in Spain and A very, very, you no, know, and we, uh, I think ever since Kudus became Kudus from New Zealand, I guess, um, like I say, and next, I don't know who you meet her, and I. Get this past weekend, and I'm even with Mr. Ewana. This year is there. Um, he's not really someone with that anger issue. Mm-hmm. But the basic theory is he knew he had to be a player and a protection because Oshet incident to you, but I think that he went for more. 
and I only really really see what you could be such a great guy and say something of that sort. And I don't really know what the guy told me. Because afterwards, um, Richard and Kura could be some of them. And I could be a sample at the of one other Sassian player. So I uh, know about three players and I'm at that point at that moment. You see, I feel like he needs to talk to you, like he needs to be talking. But aside that, uh, very normal in football because it's not too good um, of that much or it's not too interesting from him or let's just say maybe uh, he needs to go under anger management. But in all, let's also not forget that you know, the team, they were down. Mm-hmm. Because at that time, uh, they were down by four goals to one. Mm-hmm. The, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, 10, 10 sets ever was at the end. When things are not really going in your favor in football yeah sometimes it makes you overreact and all that i see i see now let's let, 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 let's talk about this uh, would he would it affect his 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 um uh his match or his subsequent matches with ghana yeah banana would it mean that if, if he's banned okay would it have to do with yeah. just uh the, the, the team which is uh, west hampton and wakana and it has to do with um also ghana football is the ban generalized or is just limited to a particular section? I think um, it happened in our England mm-hmm. and it happened in the Premier League. Mm-hmm. So the uh, idea the um, the Premier League board no, and the English FC no, and a uh, bit and their decision doesn't affect um, association football. Okay. Uh, Ghana. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it doesn't affect Ghana technically because. Um, I think our very next matches will be on the 11th and on the on the I think on the 11th and on the 15th of November. Mm-hmm. And Kudus is missing three matches. Three matches, no, which is uh, so from another to the ABF, a very like say a little more um, your next are four matches, no. ABF, oh, you have playing time. And as a player, who oh, you have playing time, you become a better. That's one major reason here. Sometimes you say play go on when you born a book time, but I could your combine and I feel a bit a bit shasty, but a very sluggish any idea. Mm-hmm. You see laws now and I say regulation is three rules from the manager. It could couldn't affect um Ghana national team. But technically with the performance no, it may affect the national team. I see, I see. Now let, let let's you saw a very busy, so let's use uh Take this last part. Um, his 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 me TBB me who be on social media say, I think send the team now of a hundred million dollars um, up. So if Chelsea wants you more a hundred million dollars also, Embra. And there are also um, speculations and one more more the seniors to Asamwajan and Co. Omuni na do manwa to me say, could you should go for the back? Cause Saudi team ni be in ten years time. Ube ni you be heading towards retirement. You know? Saudi, the What is the future of Kudus in terms of transfer and where he lands next? Um, for now, no, we can't really say much about um, the transfer life of Kudus because the transfer window isn't really open. Okay. It's going to be open in Italy. Okay. And we are in um, October now. I thought that, or I think that, generally, you know, he's just focusing on his football just to see the outcome at the back. But if I would um, advise him, uh, I suppose uh, looking at where he's from and all that, you know, he needs to go for the bag. Mm-hmm. That's the advice I can give him. I see. All right, um, Mati, and yeah, Mamin Jao Hasi, and also thank you very much for joining us. So, uh, basically, that is exactly what in your bema and Kasai about whatever is going on in terms of Mohammed Kudus. The issue, you know, uh, you need in we are following it, we're giving you more updates. Uh, address him.